Meanwhile, the house point hourglasses are slowly. Holy shit, I forgot up. to go to the house. The big old hall. The great hall, that's what it's called. Because it's great. But yeah, the point system actually counts, even though it's probably just predetermined. Ravenclaw. But you can lose, I think. Puffle if you puff. just don't get any points throughout the year, if you just fail miserably at everything. Because Slytherin's always in the lead up until Slytherin. the very last day where you get the extra points, but sometimes it's not enough. What if you don't get all the points? What if Slytherin wins? Well, it doesn't matter. Harry had a great time. Damn screen thing. Gryffindor I don't want to stop recording. I don't want to stop playing. Points. It's just so fun. Will Slytherin hold the House Cup for a seventh consecutive year? I might have to pause it and change the screen saver timings so it never goes black. Because I fucking want to play this for hours and days and years. Months and weeks and days and hours. Look at that blueness. The blueness of the sky. Oh, and Hagrid. This game. Mmm, delicious. Whoa. Hello, Harry. It's me, see Hagrid. Face? Good to see you. These are the Hogwarts Castle Grounds, and I'm the gamekeeper, of course. You'll need to attend your herbology class. Professor Sprout's in the greenhouse waiting for you. Come round my hut later for tea. I've something to ask you. My hut's in the grounds. Why did it stay on that shot for so long? I will never know! But now we got the second one of these timed things. Cool thing I learned about this is that you can actually win the thing without coming out of the the thing. You can you can just... Because if you shoot the thing Flipendo. on that side, nothing happens. But if you make it just so... Flipendo. Uh, if you make just so... Flipendo. Yeah, you can put it into place without even having to move. See, it's my six strats. I know the waves. Flipendo. I'm sticking by that that tagline. That's the, that's the tagline of this let's play. Six strats. Flipendo. OG Harry Potter. And boom. Flipendo. And all the work's done and the timer has not even started. I'm so great. Okay. And that leaves me plenty of time to collect these beans. Blue beans. Because why not? Whoa, laggedy leg. I'm surprised actually, the the set of this has been running rather smoothly the whole time. When I played Crash Bandicoot a little earlier, just to test if this would work, Crash Bandicoot 3 by the way, it was lagging like fuck, and I was like, oh, maybe this is Harry gonna Potter suck, but no, Harry Potter's, Potter's fine. Welcome to Herbology, you're just in time. I'm just in time. Good day, students. I'm Professor Sprout. Right, let's learn how to cast an incendio spell. Watch that sounds my dangerous. Move around the screen and press the symbols it points to. Complete each sequence three times to learn the incendio spell. That's the ticket. Now let's start the lesson. Okay, Get madam. Ready. That was good. You can tell that these things are going to get really hard one day. Excellent. But right now, I'm making it look easy. It's because it is. Perfect. Most impressive. Now try this one. That was good. I wish all classes were like this. Excellent. I guess I'm. Don't know why I'm saying staying so silent. Because Perfect. really, I can talk and do this at the same time. I don't need to concentrate. It's easier as fuck. Well done. You've mastered See, I'm the already a master spell. of the now incendio spell. Me to learn how to use the incendio spell. And cut. And see. Let's 
try the incendio spell to wither a bouncing bulb. Use your wand on the bouncing bulb by the door. Fuck. Hit the correct symbols and you'll build up enough spell power to That looks like a lampshade. Or a purple garbage bin with stuff in it. And I will incendio it. Incendio! Yeah. Harry, See, that's the thing, I mean, kind of weird that in the incendio doesn't actually incendiary, it just makes it small. But that's the thing I love about this game and the one that, the, uh, the one after. The spells aren't, you know, weapons. They're not, I guess the later games they had to turn into weapons because there's so much more fighting. What with the Dumbledore's army and the Death Eaters and all that, but the first three, they're more like puzzle solving mechanics. You learn the spell and you need to use the spell to f uh, figure out X or Y and do get past this thing and you can't go past that place until you learn that spell so you need to visit that class. So the classes are to help you learn the spell and it's just it feels like a good game also lovely beautiful things what are they? Okay I'm gonna s I'm gonna pause it. Whoa! You see that? You see that face? You, you made a face. What kind of face was it? Look at that! Wait. Look at that eyebrows. Look at I'm gonna zoom in on the eyebrows. Don't move your face. Look at that. He he's so sassy. He's like, what are you looking at, huh? Huh? I'm Harry Potter. Whoa! It's tough being Harry Potter. He's even doing the eyebrow wiggle. Look. Boing. Oh, is he waiting around for me to do something? Watch this. Flip endo. Flip endo. Oh, 